Like the refreshed Model 3, this car should come from China first to be sold in Asia and Europe. Now we have some more word that this car is far along in the pipeline and Tesla is getting ready to move forward with it. This is the insight shared by Ryan Shaw, a Tesla enthusiast and a YouTuber, regarding the developing progress of the upcoming Tesla Model Y, also referred to as Juniper. Initially, the car is scheduled to launch in China, followed by releases in Asia, Europe, and ultimately North America. However, numerous questions linger. When can we expect production to kick off? What's the projected output for the next generation of Model Y? Additionally, what factors influence Tesla's choice to initiate production in China? Before we delve into the details, show some love by hitting the like button to help us reach our goal of 5,000 subscribers. Let's move to the main subject at hand now. 1. When will mass production of the refreshed Model Y start? A report from Bloomberg suggests that the revamped Model Y is set to enter mass production as early as mid-2024. According to an insider, the initial batch of the latest Model Y vehicles will be made from the second phase of Tesla's Shanghai facility, which will suspend production for around a week during the New Year holiday for a partial upgrade. Furthermore, adjustments are anticipated before entering mass production as well. It's worth nothing that the reference to the New Year holiday pertains to the Chinese Lunar New Year in February, indicating an imminent production start. This stands in the contrast to earlier predictions by Reuters, which has forecasted the commencement of production for this model in October 2024. In addition, the report states that the refresh is going to feature much more obvious exterior and interior changes than Model Y update in China in October, which only features ambient lighting as a similar interior LED light stripped to the one from the new Model 3, as well as a new darker color for the stock Gemini wheels and a slightly faster acceleration with a 5.8 second 0 to 60 for the base model. It is speculated that these much more obvious changes indicate that the Model Y is adopting a new look to align with the design elements of the Model 3. Numerous fan-made mock-ups have suggested a close resemblance between these two models. Earlier 2023, Tesla introduced the refreshed Model 3 in China, dubbing the Highland, bringing a ton of new features. Among those changes it had a sleeker exterior design, sharper head, and tail lights. Upgraded interior materials, LED accent lights, improved soundproofing, 17-inch speakers, a redesigned back seat, touchscreen infotainment console, heated and ventilated from seats. Presently, the Model 3 Highland is exclusively available in Europe and Asia, with rumors circulating that it may become available in the US by early 2024. Adding to the intrigue, a Redditor recently came across a refreshed Model 3, a Tesla engineering Fremont. Upon closer inspection, the VIN revealed that the vehicle was constructed at Tesla's Fremont factory. 2. What is the projected production volume for Model Y Juniper in 2024? How many new Model Ys? will be produced in 2024 hinges significantly on Tesla's manufacturing pace, particularly at the Shanghai factory, which plays a pivotal role in Model Y production. According to Inside AV data, the Giga Shanghai has the potential to manufacture over 950,000 Model 3 Model Y units annually, surpassing previous estimates by 200,000 units. Furthermore, projections from Troy dislike a data-driven source on X Estimate that 167,000.680 Model Y will be produced in Q4 2023. Notably, Giga Shanghai factory boasts an impressive manufacturing speed, with a Model Y or Model 3 rolling off the production line every 40 seconds. This speed outpaces even Ford, who claimed in January 2023 press release that a new F-150 is produced in Dearborn. Michigan every 52 seconds. If Tesla maintains this accelerated production rate for Model Y Juniper and the production line operates continuously from mid-2024 onward, the daily output would be 2,160 cars, extrapolating from deaths. It would literally result in the production of 394,200 refreshed Model Y units 
by the end of 2024. 3. Why did Tesla choose Giga Shanghai to initiate production for the new Model Y? Introduced in 2020, Model Y has rapidly gained immense popularity, securing its position among the top-selling electric vehicle models globally. Notably, it becomes Tesla's leading seller in China, commanding a substantial 60.5% share of the total Tesla production in this country. In November, Tesla's Giga Shanghai achieved a milestone by setting a new monthly production record, turning out an impressive 90,802 Model 3 and Model Y vehicles. Adding to the demand, Model Y is reportedly sold out for the entire year of 2023 in China. In pursuit of an ambitious target of 1.8 million vehicle sales in 2023, Tesla aimed to deliver approximately 476,000 electric vehicles in the fourth quarter. The company officially confirmed its performance on Tuesday, revealing impressive results that surpassed Wall Street expectations. Tesla achieved a delivery milestone of 484,507 vehicles in the fourth quarter, exceeding the projected figure of 480,483. The year of 2023 proved to be a monumental one for Tesla, with a total of 1,800,008.581 vehicles delivered throughout the entire year. Additionally, the Q4 production also reached a high record at 494,989 vehicles. Investors and enthusiasts can anticipate further insights into Tesla's performance as the company is scheduled to release its Q4 earnings on January 24, 2024. Giving the sustained appeal of Model Y in the expanding Chinese electric vehicle industry and the fact that the popularity of the SUV is aligned with the preferences of Asian consumers, it makes strategic sense for Tesla to prioritize this market. Based on statistics, the SUV market in Asia is poised for substantial growth, with projected revenue reaching $317 million.500,000 in 2024, anticipated to exhibit an annual growth rate SAGR 2024 to 2028 of 4.17%. The market is literally forecasted to expand to a volume of 373 million point eight hundred thousand by 2028. This data underscores the strategic significance of Tesla's focus on the Asian market, especially with Model Y, to capitalize on the region's growing demand for electric SUVs. Focusing on the Chinese market also means that Tesla wants to improve Model Y Juniper's competitiveness with domestic car models, especially those that are produced by the BYD. A recent Investor's Business Daily article published on the first day of the year highlighted the BYD's remarkable achievements in surpassing Tesla in all electric vehicle sales. In December alone, the BYD recorded a staggering 341,043 EVs sold, propelling its 2023 sales to an impressive 3,012,906 and surpassing its full-year target of 3 million EVs. This stark contrast to Tesla's 1.8 million cars delivered in the previous year underscores the need for Tesla to devise a strategic solution to remain competitive, especially with the SUV segment where BYD boasts notable offerings such as the BYD Tang, the BYD Auto 3, and the C-Lion 07. And that was a wrap for today's comprehensive updates on Tesla's Juniper production plan for 2024. What are your thoughts on this development? Can the refreshed Tesla Model Y surpass the BYD SUV? What innovation will be possibly applied to the Juniper production line to increase output? Share all of your thoughts down below in the comment section now. And if you enjoyed this video, feel free to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel and turn on your notifications bell so you never miss out on any of our upcoming videos. Thank you for watching until the end. See you again.